We're back. We're back. We're back. Are we live? We're live. It's so funny, dude, seeing all those comments like, Oh, I hope we're not ending the show. We are. <laughs> we made it to 69. <laughs> no, 70. Nope, we made it to 69. I thought set 69 would be a fun number to end on. Uh, I think you do 70. No, you, 69. You're proud of that? They'll give them the satisfaction. Yeah, yeah but I think you have to because we're not then doing it anymore. Then no, I'm going to say it. This makes it seem purposeful. No, you just call it 70. I know what you don't mean. Do I'm going to call it 83 then. My vote's in for 83. 69 because it that, looks purposeful. That or episode 100. Mm, kind of like that too. <laughs> Can you believe it? We got to 100 episodes. <laughs> What do Almost you think of that? two years. Couldn't quite hack it. What Everybody you- makes a, like a big thing, like a hundred episodes. Can you believe it? Also, people say that you, you start coming to your stride at a hundred episodes. What do you think? A hundred? Mm. That was just, a very disparaging. Let's, let's just, you had strong know. opinions let's, three let's seconds just, ago. Let's just move on. We'll figure it out later. I like this conversation for our mm. last episode. Just fucking. Us arguing over which number <laughs> for the whole time. Yeah, well, I vote either 69 or 100. I. I prefer the denial of 70 in like them thinking they missed an episode, you know? Like, I, oh, wait, we're 69. That's, they, they haven't posted in six weeks, so that, that, that made one. perfect sense to me until it was the last episode, and then 69 seems like we meant to end it now. I just think it's gay to mean to end it on 69, though. It's Especially a funny if number. you keep it. It's it was either 69 episodes in, or we said, if we're having a good time, we'll go to 420. Mm. We got to 69 and we thought to ourselves, <laughs> <laughs> but there's also something funny though, of like episode 100, big extravaganza. So then when you look back on the videos, it's one through 68. And I then do it like the, goes to I do like the memes of like, I can't seem to find the 31 episodes where the missing 31 episodes. What did, why do they delete those? Yeah. Mm. What did they say in that stretch? Yeah, exactly. We should just call this. I'm like, we're sorry, whatever. This is it's our apology. Yeah, so it's like we deleted a large portion. And we should delete like a handful of episodes as well to make it look like we're trying to hide something. Okay, well, now it sounds like you're actually trying to hide something. Just random <laughs> episodes. <laughs> Just, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know random like, what about the Dragon Ball Z one? Is what? that was kind of a weird thing to hide? Or <laughs> Okay. I just I thought it was funny. Well, Welcome back to Cream Crew. For the final time. For the final time. We should, we, we, should, we should have a sad. We should have a sad uh, theme then for the. I'm gonna do. If you guys want to make it happen, go ahead. But I'm doing no more work on this. No more. I'm gonna upload these files and then I'm done. If you sign, I can just do it myself. And you just take this recording and use it at the beginning. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> the final scoop with sprinkles. I'm not gonna finish. Welcome back to Cream Crew. <laughs> I thought he already did with the whole thing. No, it has a finale. It oh. just shows how much attention you've been paying for a year and a half. A hundred episodes. Your anger at me. A hundred mm-hmm. episodes, and you still never got the theme song mm-hmm. right. I don't want to do any more work on this. Not a lick. A good ice cream pun. Mm-hmm. None of the lick. Um, I never want to do another. Uh, I, I don't want to do any more work on. I, I don't want to do another popsicle worth of work on this anymore. I, I don't well, want to. How about how about this? Sprinkle we need, of my we need to. We need to, what? What loose threads do we need to wrap up? I guess we could start off. We could ruin a, a huge part of the show. Should we ruin a huge part of the show? Well, go ahead. And we'll decide to cut it. Well, well leave, I, leave in the I part where com- you said let's ruin a huge part, and then we'll decide. Well, just after. just to clarify, though, I'm not doing a sprinkle more worth of work on this. So, if there's anything that needs to be cut, you need to take it out with the editor. Yeah. Were you just autistically? Thinking, I thought of another one in your mind. Is that why you were looking at me like this the whole time? No, that was because Don came for my juggler, and I thought there would be camaraderie mm-hmm. in this final episode. There is camaraderie. I'll, I'm going to ruin something for the audience. Okay, go ahead. I just want to throw it out there. Yeah. Don is not actually addicted to pussy. Doesn't eat it. Doesn't sloppily eat it. No, no winks. How could you, how could you do that to 
the fans. I just want people to know the truth. That was a that whole conversation, the bit. That was me with a voice changer. Don didn't actually call in. He didn't call in. Man. He wasn't gone. I forgot why you were gone. Why were you gone? That, do you remember that weekend while you were gone? Because my audio equipment wasn't working. We oh, because you were out we of were town. Gonna, no, we were going to record the next day. But instead, I don't remember that. Uh-huh. Boys, you, you, you can you've see had, why you, this podcast uh-huh. is ending right you've before had, your eyes. You've had that narrative for a while. <laughs> that is and literally I, what and happened. I feel, you say I was out of town, but we didn't even live together yet. Everyone was out of town. Tom lived in fucking no, Texas. I was, what in, I, mean, I was in town. What I mean by I was that there. was that you were away out of town, away from your gear. You tried to get it working, and it was a, a horror. It was a horror Yeah, I had show. to go to Best Buy and get a cable, and I was going to do that. But instead of that, you see, Tom texted me. Yeah, we just recorded it. No, me. my memory was you gave us permission to. I, you said if you guys I, just I, want I, to attack I, I, yourself, find, find I, the text. I'm anyway. not going to go it through. Was a, I think it was on a call. An ounce more of work <laughs> mm-hmm. for this podcast. You guys are not listening. Okay. I'm, I'm not, not going to. I'm not going to do another pint worth of work. Well, anyway, uh, uh, do you have pint? I guess you do have pints. Yeah, cream. pints. You just you just robbed me of my entire personality. How we gave you, you a personality. I'm sorry. This is what I said. Uh-huh. I said you know what would be funny because uh, during the time in the back, Don really hated that we had this this gag that we were doing. Mm-hmm. Where we would just say that he eat, he eats pussy, which in, in a lot of guys that would be really not a bad gag. That wasn't no, a, there wasn't even a bad a gag before you guys did that though. You invented it for the no. Episode. We definitely were we were no. definitely doing oh, it before behind my back, perhaps. Probably I, I had never Probably. heard that before in my life. Well, how do you bring it up to you? Well, we sat there. <laughs> <laughs> we got to break it to dawn one of these days. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I, I, I got thought to myself. Joke. Well, are you gonna let me finish this or not? I'm trying to ruin the podcast all right, for people all right, here. All right. So I said to I said to Tom, "You'd be a funny podcast." Is that the whole time we should talk about how t- 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 Don likes eat pussy, and he you said this isn't going to go over well. And did it become our most infamous episode after heavy, heavy editing? Not that on heavy. my part. Not that heavy. Okay. Not that heavy. We you you like don't you like hours. to give me nothing. You like to give it four mm. hours, my ass. Yeah, four hours, and we got it down to like twenty minutes, and it was good. It was. The, I remember the original cut was cringe, and then it was very carefully. Not true. Down to people funny. they're trying to disparage me and my ideas <laughs> this is bullshit they hate that whenever i have weird ideas like this and it works out they just it, it eats you away at your core doesn't it it's true it eats you away at your at my cone cone <laughs> <laughs> what is a what's a what, what a pint is just the yeah what's the one you get from the a tub? <clears throat> a quart. Is it a quart? A quart of ice cream. Yep. Or a tub. A quart I like what well, we got two really more. really get quarts use. of ice cream? Mm-hmm. That's just wacky. I think that's like the... Yeah, it's a little, the oblong one. Oblong. Those like the, yeah, that's like the... That's a fun mm-hmm. word, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Oblong. You know, every series, every film, every piece of media, every good human story has an amount of change in it. Oh. Yeah, well, you know, close... I thought, the, I thought you were saying has an end. Has an end, mm. but... The people along the way learn something. Mm. And through this whole venture, I want to ask Hunter, what have you learned? How have you changed as a person from this? How have I changed as a person? Uh, Being around you guys has been an eye-opener. I'm definitely uh, more pessimistic. I don't have a lot of light in my life anymore. Uh, I think that I like to psychoanalyze things as if it matters. And I think that I have uh, truly fallen back into a deep, deep rooted depression. Didn't you move here because you were in a deep rooted depression and thought this would fix it's it? It's a bit both. It is a bit both. But see, it, it was, uh, who knows if it's the right move. You know, I'm not here to say this or that. Uh, but, you know, this is the last episode of the podcast. So you be the judge of that. <laughs> does, <laughs> does a man who gets on a plane out of nowhere and says, I'm coming to live in Texas, sound like a stable man hey, who wasn't already look depressed? At look at this. Okay. Shoot from the hip. <laughs> Shoot from the hip. That's right. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Well, How about good. you, Tom? How about you, Tom? What have I learned? Hmm. Don't trust your friends. That's what That's I've a learned. I probably learned that too. Yep. You know. You cool. What What taught you that lesson? What taught Just, you guys that lesson? Don't trust your friends. What do you mean, you guys? Why? why, why well, Hunter, Hunter friends? didn't say he didn't trust his friends. He just said uh, mm. we, we made him depressed and well, psychoanalyzed. He, he just said he just agreed with you. He concurred. Oh, you so, concurred. Yeah. 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 Why, well, I said, why did you learn that? Mm-hmm. I think it's just over a series of things. It's kind of the same thing of whenever you're getting an argument with your spouse and you said, you didn't do the dishes. And you're like, when did that happen? It's like, oh, do I, do I have that written down? What day? I think mm. it's just more so you have it in the back of your mind. I see. Just lingers on your soul. Which I assume that's what you did, you're saying too. It's just a, it's over the course of you let things slide. 
you 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 all you, you do things out of love, but you also you hold uh you, you hold tallies. I like to imagine you all have a large amount of tallies against me. I have a book of grudges for yeah. sure. I'm a book of grudges kind of guy. Mm. It's this thick. Let's get let's get into an it. old monk like Bible. I don't, I don't know if we need to uh, end but, on such a sour note. Oh, we got 50 minutes to fill with something. We could fill it with light-hearted camaraderie. A tight 60. <laughs> and fun, fun times. Oh, no, now we, we have you 50. You seem hell-bent on death and destruction, Don. We have 50 you do, left. You do seem we like have a... We have 50 <laughs> left. You, see, so. you, seem like a, you seem like a kettle that's... Yeah. It's like steaming and bubbling and stuff. I want to see it explode. I want to hear what you have to say, Don. Mm. I, I'm just systematically going through the things. I want everyone to feel satisfied with the end of the show. It's like, oh, we never got to talk about this, you know. <laughs> I feel like it's you or you're saying that. I, I'm having yeah. I'm having a lovely time. Yeah. I, at the same time, it feels like uh, to keep this dated because it doesn't matter anymore. Right. I feel like uh, Chris Rock, and I feel like I'm looking at Will Smith. I don't see. I yeah. I really don't <laughs> want to date it like that. I, I this like. This needs to be like evergreen. It. This ending. This execution. You look like some guy looking for an iPhone 13. <laughs> iPhone, what do you mean? It's the newest version of the iPhone right now. Oh, and so then later on, when people go do so this, be mad. Oh, I see. It'll, it'll, it's dating. dating. Yeah, I'm just yeah, dating. Gotcha. You look like a man looking for an iPhone 4G. Looking for an I, uh, iPhone 4S. Mm. Now we're going back in time. <laughs> <laughs> what have you learned, Don? I just want to hear your grudges. I don't want to why'd weigh you, down the why'd podcast. You, why'd you bring them up? You didn't. I was to... just saying what I learned. You said I. I learned I don't trust my friends. You don't want to get into it. True. You're right. Friends was too strong of a word. I don't trust my colleagues. I thought you were going to say, I don't trust Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust my colleagues. Oh, is it, well, that's probably actually what it's about, though, is the whole Hunter lies all the time thing, right? No, that can't be it. I feel like... I, I mean, I, th I actually I initially thought he was driving at something else. I don't know what, but that's not what I thought initially. So I think Hunter has taken to lying less recently that's, that's probably i think true. that's actually his character arc is yeah. hunter hasn't lied for a while the last time he lied to me and i kn know he lied to me is when i tried to get him to take his health seriously and order some vitamins online and he told me he I did, did. It, and then he didn't do it <laughs> no sir so it was just an easier way just to stop the conversation it's generally how lies go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah i'm not saying it's not a lie i'm just saying that it was it was a way for it to to, to halt it to halt yeah uh-huh well, um, fair enough. That's the last time, and that was months ago. You could have maybe, lied to me, and I don't know. Maybe five or six months ago. But that's true. You don't even know. I could yeah. have gotten him. Why would you say you started lying less? Where does that arc I think he from? saw the hurt it caused. Uh. I think you guys do get uh, irrationally upset with joke lies. <laughs> uh -huh. I've never had any other friends get as upset. Like about buying You've health never pills. had... Any other friends so dedicated to your well-being and general happiness, it just shows a sign that they didn't really care about you at all. Well, for some reason, those are long-standing friends. I wasn't there. Did you get upset with them? No, I was just like, eh. Oh. It's par for the course. No, it's just Tom. It, it's 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 a hard read. Mm. Tom does have a lot of a lot of heart, so I think that when he says things, I think that it's still in this backwards way of being like, well, I did take time. To have this conversation with you, so it's still rooted in yourself a bit, but I think that, <laughs> but that it, that it's uh, that. But I don't I win but, anything, fuck. No, well, none of us are going to win anything ever. That's the that's the problem. But I think it's just yeah, it's like uh, he, he 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 cared enough to say it, and then I disregarded it. <laughs> right, it's that thing. Which you know, to be fair, there it is. I you know I can see I can see the hurt. Mm. I can see the pain. All right, well done. <laughs> no, well that was an aside. You were still getting it. You seem very reluctant to say what you've learned on this journey or changed. Mm. What if he's thinking about it still? Well, we've got tight 40 minutes now, so... Has it been another 10 minutes? Going to have to think pretty quick. No, okay, we've got been, a tight 45 it's, minutes. It's been like three minutes since the last the time. It feels so long. It's weird. Tight 45. Tight 45. 45, 45. <laughs> what do you got, Don? How did you change over this wonderful journey? <sighs> I think I learned to dream less. Probably, probably the best. <laughs> Literally, word to dream less. <laughs> <laughs> as as we sit at this table that took about twenty hours to make, and uh, what are you gonna do to this table? I don't know. It's your baby. Who the fuck knows? Set on fire. Well, we uh, shouldn't set it on fire. Yeah, I, I sit in front of the uncomplete uh, garage door that was meant to have a, <laughs> at one point, four thousand dollar ice cream truck prop put behind me. Aren't you glad I talked you out of that now? Mm. Uh, 
who, who knows? Who knows what I could have done? Who, who knows? I think that that would have happened. I think that would have spent that money. Together. Yeah, I think maybe that we would have made it to eighty episodes. I, I think that that's that, the fucking that's or hundred eighty. You mean? That's like yeah. having that's like parents having kids to try and keep the marriage together. It's a band aid. It's never going to work. If anything, it's probably going to cause more problems. Uh, but you 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 tough it out miserably at least for a little well, while. The, well, the, what kind of life is that, Don? Is that what you want for our children? It's, yeah, it's not about us. It's about the fans. They probably think, wow. It's about the children. Do you know just, the fans that, might man, be that happier? Been, that would have been great. If, if mum and dad just... split apart mm -hmm. and would stop creating this horrible atmosphere mm -hmm. to grow up in. Children uh, across the board do not do as well mental health wise from broken homes. Well, that's very true. But what if the broken home is one in which they get raped and abused? And if they were separated apart, the parents, they would no longer get raped who's, and abused. They'd probably who's, do better. Who's, who's raping and abusing the children? Who's the we're all doing it. I'm, I'm, I don't no, think I haven't in touched In this hypothetical I never scenario. Touched, I have never I, touched a fan. I, I've, I've, I know you have. Don, as the man who's not allowed to I didn't to see it at Comic-Con for Hunter, a long time. <laughs> although Hunter has uh, deleted comments. Does that count as raping and... Oh yeah, I just want to break. If you've ever comments, had a comment just, deleted, just as far as, this, as far as this metaphor goes, <laughs> there, there, I have I children. will say a lot of people say like, oh, I've, like they'll be like, oh, I on episodes where I haven't touched. Like it's been a long time since I've done that. I do think YouTube just like deletes shit. Also, YouTube unsubscribes you from things. It's just mm. fucking weird. Well, if you. If you comment something that's too profane or whatever, YouTube will automatically hide it. Yeah, we'll say yeah, like the health this review is potentially or horrible, and then you have to go manually approve it. And obviously, yeah. none of us are going to fucking. Like going to spend time. There's a yeah. whole other fucking yeah comment yeah. section where it's like approve. And it's like I'm not going to take time to do that. What the fuck do I care? The n-word fields, as I call them. Tall grass. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Elysium. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Matt Damon's walking around with a fucking robot suit in there. Not what I meant, but absolutely. I was just trying to bring it back to a peaceful place. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's what he meant. It was Matt Damon, Elysium. Yeah, I meant more just the Roman mm. place, you know, whatever. But I mm. guess that's probably what that's named after, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, I don't know. Well, I'm glad we all learned so much. And what about, did the fans uh, learn? Mm. All right, this is what I hope the fans learned. I hope you learned that if you don't spread our content to the point where it's incredibly <laughs> <quit>. viral... <laughs> <laughs> then it's not going to work out. How long can you put in money, resources, time into a product that you don't like? This is real life, you know? Yeah. The thing you love is going to die if you don't fucking you know what keep I, it on life support. You know what I hope that they learn? What's that? Is that they, they, they saw us as human beings and they're, they're happy for, the, for us. That they're happy for this change that's going to happen. Hmm. And that they still have, they have an archive of stuff, of old memories. It's going to be like looking through a scrapbook. A, sh a small scrapbook. But a scrapbook a of that. A hundred episode big scrapbook. A hundred episode big scrapbook. Which also, at the same time, you're welcome. What are you going to do when Joe Rogan's done? Go back thousands of episodes? Hmm. Well, yeah, we did make it short. It's tight. It's tight, tight community. Exactly. Yeah. You're hmm. welcome. Yeah. Every, every episode, uh, 500 less people, you know. And you couldn't really only blame yourselves for not showing back up. <laughs> you know, Tom, uh, you're speaking a lot of facts right now. I know. That's what I do. I like that. Truth teller. Truth seeker. I feel like I was trying to I was trying to soften the blow a bit, but now I, I want to take it back. Your kids won't grow up right if you don't tell them the truth about certain things. That Cream Crew was the greatest podcast to ever exist. Yeah. And if you're fucking little shit and don't tell your friends about it, your like parents are going to break up. Cream Crew to me feels like if Prometheus sacrificed and, you know, he stole fire and the humans were like, nah. Yeah, I like that. I think that's true. So, so Cream but Crew then I'm me, still shackled yeah. down and still getting my shit eaten out every day by vultures. Yeah, you're, you're still punished. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Dude, it, it's, a, it, it's a bit of a sour taste, isn't it? Having yeah. to be strapped to that rock. Well, I was going to I was gonna say, if we're doing, if we're doing Greek... Uh, metaphors. Oh, Cream Crew to me, it was a Sisyphean boulder mm. that I single-handedly try to push up the hill every day. Mm. <laughs> I will say your your fans are the are the loudest. Yep, you're appreciated. Yep, good men, good folk. Do you feel that you uh, do you feel like you came away the strongest out of this? Um, no. Well, I disagree. Mm. Are you disappointed that we never got to find out if you were really a Nazi? Or if it was all just a joke. I'm more disappointed that we never really got to find out if you were a gypsy or not. I think that's the biggest. Well, if you want to, well, to segue now, I was going to save it to the end, but I did get my results back. Already? Mm -hmm. 
So you want to do it? You want to do this now? Yeah. How, how about, yeah let's, 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 do it. let's do it in the middle of the episode so it's harder. So to we can talk yeah. about it. Yeah. And then they might get the answer to what you brought yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Which is what? Well, we have to start, we're just find out if you're really an exactly. Oh, okay. Okay. So it turns out that when it comes to West Indian descent, I am zero point zero percent <laughs> gypsy. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh my god. Absolutely no heritage outside of Europe. I got to see this dashboard, dude. I'm so excited. But yeah, let's let's look at the breakdown here, boys. Hold on. Yeah, I, I do. I am actually curious. All right. So. Oh yeah, I'm fascinated. Mm -hmm. In a non-Nazi way. European 100.0%. <laughs> <laughs> Even genetic noise. No, no, no There's nothing noise. in there. No to noise. It's just <laughs> no, just uh, one trillion fucking percent. Uh huh. So I think I can get an expanded view of all the of all, of all the populations I'm not a part of. Don, I might literally be more 0. gypsy than you. He's a he's like he's a thoroughbred over there. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. a show pony. Yeah, it's a little pedigree going on. Well, I do I do a point six Spanish and Portuguese. So just a little greasy flex. That's, that's where that's the right. that's where I <laughs> suspect the dark nipples come from. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fourteen point nine percent Eastern European. What? How much? Fourteen point nine Eastern uh, European. Fourteen point nine. Okay. Yeah. yeah. What's a Eastern European? What would that be? Uh, that's Poland, like, uh, Russia. Mm. Fucking, I don't know. Uh, man, I, there was a way to look at the expanded thing where you could see really all. Do the you know, having I'm met not... both of both sets of your grandparents, yes. I was always skeptical about the claims of gypsiness, just because they were so incredibly pale mm. with blue eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Italian, 0%. 0% Italian. Mm. Ashkenazi Jewish is 0%. Central and South Asian, that would be the one. 0.0%. 0 .0%. <laughs> that would uh, be the one. Uh, Bengali and Northeast Indian, 0.0%. 0 .0%. Yeah. Can I see it? So, what does yeah, yeah. the like 85% come in? So is yeah. it just all are over just, Europe? Are you mostly it's, German? It's, yeah, it's all German and uh, mm. the neighboring one. I forget. The neighboring one, France? France? Yeah, French. France. <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. That's a good you way. You well that, that, That's a good way no, to think no, of France. The, uh, well, yeah, the the uh, I think they're too genetically similar, so it doesn't mm. make a delineation. Right, but. right. But yeah, this man is uh, just eighty three percent Northwestern European, and all the rest of it is Slav. Don, you can start fucking squatting and wearing Adidas tracksuits, and it's not Ooh, cultural appropriation. That's true. That's true. It's nothing but Adidas tracksuits from now on, <laughs> and uh, Lederhosen, gold chains. My heart does really weep for Ukraine too. About fifteen percent of my heart weeps for. <laughs> so uh, when you went to that, um, <laughs> when we when we did that video and we went to the Renfro and you dressed as a gypsy, that was actually incredibly distasteful. <laughs> well, it was under the false understanding. Yeah, and and just, ba just the basic just uh, basic basic trust in a family member. You know, yeah, mm. not my fault at all. Have you sent this to your brother? No. I, I might call him later today. And That's going to be a hilarious him. conversation. You're going to be like, oh, I've got something to tell you, I bro. Desperately, so I sorry. desperately want you to send it to your sister. Even if we don't no, keep I this part. I desperately want to send what it to you, your what sister. You, we're going to keep all of it. Not mm. one more ounce of work. <laughs> <laughs> so no, so, so is that going to be even no first, notes? Uh, the first unedited podcast. Yeah. This is yeah. it, boys. You're getting it yeah. real and fucking raw. All right. This is a pressure cooker situation. <clears throat> I think that'd be all right. Yeah, there hasn't been a dull moment so far, right? No, we've had, yeah. we closed one of the biggest threads on this uh, mm -hmm. podcast. If not the biggest thread. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It's ironic because before that would have been grounds to throw him off the podcast, but now it's ending, so it doesn't matter. Well, it, if anything, we're, throw, we're all throwing ourselves off the podcast because he doesn't have that. If, he, if it would have turned out that he was a gypsy. We would have had our POC shield that we've needed this whole time. Mm. Mm. So it would have been full steam ahead. Yeah, we could have just said and done literally anything. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm a little disappointed too, as you can imagine. Uh, of course. Are you, yeah. How are you going to browbeat anyone now? Mm -hmm. I'm curious. Do you think I'm a gypsy? Now I'm, I'm questioning myself. Well, I don't, I've always suspected, you know. You're, you do why a lot. <laughs> 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 that is uh, that is the it's just that is the character. There's something in your blood, yeah. I just can't fight the urge. <laughs> it feels so deep rooted within me. I don't. I feel like now we all have to do it, you know. Mm. But no one's ever gonna. Know. I, that was that was a fun review. How long did that take? I mean, it was it was a little faster, yeah. Because I, I thought you I thought you said something like I thought that was something crazy like three months or something you said. Yeah, I, I did. Was it that quick? I didn't was, think I'd get it till next. I just time. don't want to yeah. give my DNA to some random company. That's how they found the Golden State Killer. <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. yeah. 
Because he did Ancestry, though. You know where I... Where, no, where his, am I from? His, <laughs> his, his, like, his uh, granddaughter did it or something. And they're like, hold on a second. Well, they must have... Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Hmm. So I... Oh, so they're going to find me anyway. Okay. Well, yeah, I, I mean, well like, I, I think that it was more yeah, so that his dumb, granddaughter did it. What if they put me on a list for being white? Hmm. How would you Which they would otherwise never be able to tell. How would you hide that? That's the joke. That's the bit. I get it. Yeah. So. Well, that was fun. Mm-hmm. I love, I love, it I does love f- now that your sister is in this Michael Scott esque prison Mike situation. <laughs> prison Mike. <laughs> yeah, I'm a gypsy. Mm. Yeah, we travel around in caravans and we try to sell rugs to people. So your sister, uh, despite claiming to be the oppressed, probably more likely would have been the oppressor historically speaking. Mm-hmm. As, I mean, as like I mean, a thoroughbred German, literally. <laughs> If human history has taught us anything, that is quite the case. Wow, fascinating. I, it's awesome. I love that. Well, what other chapters are there to close? Uh, what, what other dreams did I have for the set? We did the... We, we were going to get that the vinyl thing yeah, to the we, top we, there. We were going to make this, Stinky this thing, and stuff him in. This You never you would never know it because there's just drinks in there, but this was meant to resemble an ice cream machine, and we were going to get custom uh, ice cream tubs made to go in there, and I, I bought the supplies and the little little boy outfit for a tinky uh prop that was a long time how long was gonna was go that? there uh, a couple months ago it was only that long mm-hmm. ago yeah it oh. wasn't too long but <clears throat> yeah i bought i bought uh two big blocks like of um eps foam to carve his head out of you also bought garage. all of tinky's clothes no yep i think mm-hmm. still what we should do just so that thing doesn't go to waste because it work does it work mm-hmm. we could put that Somewhere in the house and put and still get the crew crew thing for it and I have was, it be a little cooler. Yeah, I was thinking that too. I think it'd be fun to put it a little like memento where uh, Cats was originally going to go mm-hmm. in the corner, a little then, corner right there, mm-hmm. and little. then put yeah Tinky in there and like chain it up. Yeah, mm-hmm. go ahead, chain it up. That's mm-hmm. fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what else? I wanted to do that, and then oh, we we're going to do stencils on these boxes. Mm-hmm. Have nice little cream crew logos. The truck was going to have a working door for that, guests. that guests would would come out of, and it'd be really fun. It's true. Yeah. Nice. And then uh, the, that guy that uh, we got a quote from that was that had to have been like just a scam. Probably mm-hmm. just he didn't want to do it, so he quoted some crazy figure. No, I think well, four grand was uh, the walk down initially. So he wanted to build like a literal half of a fucking truck because he was I don't know a psycho. I think he just didn't well, probably because he's not used to dealing with well, like. Part-time yeah. YouTubers. Mm-hmm. And part-time. Actual, oh, part-time actual, YouTubers. That's our fucking... Part-time podcasters. Part-time yeah. YouTubers. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, so how, how... What are we going to do with this room? How, how? Well, for starters, how are we going to destroy this set and scatter the pieces? Can I finally come on the table? That's a threat. <laughs> I think that... Li- li- literally, if you want... But if you do that, you ha- Don't take a picture of your cock or anything. Take a picture of the cum on the table and put it up on the Reddit. <laughs> That I'm would just, make people happy. I'm saying literally do that. What if people judge my cum? What What are we doing with the table what is there first? To what, what? It might not be enough. It might mm-hmm. be too much. It might look like slightly <clears throat> wrong color. You gotta, I don't know until it's up there. You got to edge for a while. You don't know how to control <clears throat> the viscosity and the amount of... No, Don, color. I haven't deep dived my cum. You're a pretty healthy eater. I'm sure it's fine. Mm-hmm. Yeah, who knows? Is it that's stinky? The, that's the fear, isn't it? If you tell me, I can't. I don't know if it's stinky compared to other cum. I'll mm-hmm. give you. I'll tell you my exact schedule. I won't even come in for the rest of the week, so I'll never. You'll never f- have the feeling that someone's walking in on you. And you can just How come, come, come on this come table then? anytime. Oh, do you want that? I'll tell you exactly what days I'm coming in then. <laughs> I want to be a surprise. <laughs> okay, At just some random point. I'm going to come on this table. <clears throat> what do we? Actually... You're going to clean it up, though. Well, okay. What about not one more ounce of work? Does cum, does it average cum weigh an ounce? I doubt it. Okay, well then, fine. It, I can do that, but <laughs> not one more ounce of work. <laughs> I would just say, I'm just out of being polite. I imagine, I wonder, because you know if you spill like uh, syrup stuff or like, you know, sweet stuff, it attracts ants. What does cum attract? <laughs> <laughs> cum <Hunter's mom's> is- <laughs> yeah. True. Mm. <laughs> what am I, that's weird. Tom, did you come to the table? My mom's coming down immediately. <laughs> Sorry, mom. She listens to this podcast. Oh, well, she might be soon. That's another thread for you. Uh, Hunter's dad is going to visit next week, but because that. because this podcast is ending, there's no chance. Nope. Of told him. you already that even if it wasn't ending, he wouldn't. No, have. no. Well, if it had continued, if if only the podcast had gotten bigger and more views, then the <laughs> inevitable your arrival of your dad would have been on this podcast, well, and we would have complete. Well, no, we never got to hear from your parents. 
Oh, uh, that would have been yeah. fucking. A, that that would have been a banger episode. That would have been My fun. parents hold their own. Would have been fun. <clears throat> ah, who knows? One day, maybe boys. You know, not to give yeah. any false hope, but we could all. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not, yeah, gonna put no it, I'm not even going to put it. I'm not even going to put it. I'm not even going to put it out there. This is dead. We're taking it out back, putting it in the sun. It's going to melt. That's stinky. That was, that was nice. Hmm. That was nice. Mm -hmm. Melt the podcast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. A little better than sprinkle one. You know, I uh, I evolve creatively mm -hmm. every second. I'm sad we every never got second. to get my dad back. So that was a good episode. That was fun. Mm. He probably would have come back this year. I wonder if uh, did you fart on? No. Okay. No, I wonder if. If it had been your mum, your dad, and me, if the podcast would have done better. Probably. Mm. Well, Hunter's mom did want to fuck my dad. So. She wants to fuck everyone. It's <laughs> hardly an accolade. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there would have been a lot of t t like tension flying. I know. Me and, me and your dad's trying to like compete out uh -huh. for each other. Mm -hmm. Try and get Missy's attention. When she comes in here and Will Smith slaps you, the thing that happened yesterday... <laughs> <laughs> Stop dating the goddamn podcast. Then uh, don't don't be surprised when you get slapped slap in the face. See, this is a problem. He's normalized. No, we're not talking about this. Mm. We're not dating the podcast. This could ha have happened at any point in history. Mm. Timeless final hundredth. Boy, that paper. that bubonic plague, huh? Wiping <laughs> out a third of Europe. Mm -hmm. God, that's. I hope that doesn't get me. Now, no one knows when this was recorded. <laughs> <clears throat> Euphoria season three still hasn't been announced yet. The second season just finished, but <laughs> boy, uh, Euphoria season six was interesting, but only equally as interesting. Okay, as seven, well, eight, season, nine, 10, season three is gonna be the last one. And one. Season three is gonna be the last one. So you're you looking very dumb. Well, um, you clearly are not from the future where it's been renewed seventeen times. <gasps> you're talking from the future and the past oh and the God. present. Okay. It's like, a real you're, chronology. You're, you're a Christmas ghost is what you are, essentially. No. Isn't that the Christmas ghost yes. does? He goes to the past and the future? No. They all come to Scrooge's bedside. Only Scrooge? Hmm? Well, that's a good question. Do you reckon they uh, approach a lot There's of There's got to be other people that probably get a Christmas ghost. That's probably true. Other billionaires. Donald Trump. Yeah. Isn't it called like the ghost of Christmas past, but he always takes them to the future of like, this is what will happen when... There's different you... ghosts. There's different ghosts. There's... there's more than one ghost yeah. in the Scrooge yeah, story? There's, there's three. I thought that he just shows them three instances. No, no, no. There's different ghosts. Oh, wow. I'm the ghost of Christmas past. I'm the ghost of Christmas future. Okay, okay. This is going to be fun. Which ghost is which? Out of us. That's... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Huh? I don't even know all three of them. <laughs> past, future, present. Oh, is that? Mm -hmm. is that no, I'm just no, guessing. I th th wasn't there like futures that? Uh, oh, I guess it would just be future. Yeah. Who knows? Which one are we? Which one are we? Yeah. It'd be fun. You're past. Why? Why am I past? Because you're old news. Mm -hmm. You're future because you have an aspiring heart, and I'm mm -hmm. present because I'm a man. I'm a normal man. No, I don't have an aspiring heart anymore. That's the character died. Change. I will be. I would the, say your future. I'm I will be the future. You're present. Yeah. I'm I'm clinging to this bitterly. Doesn't that make you past? No, it's because I'm sitting here and I'm thinking this. But you're like I said, to Tom. Past. Tom, you're old news. That's mm -hmm. why your ghost of Christmas. You past. know, sometimes mm -hmm. old news becomes new news. New news. When they find uh, the they actually dig, they dig up details. Yeah. Well, the the oh, whole story ooh. changes. That mm -hmm. may, well, see, that makes you even more ghost of Christmas <laughs> past. If people are digging up the past to make it new news. Right. Hmm. So would you be ghost of Christmas past then? I, you know, I'll accept the moniker placed upon me by the council. It's <laughs> weird. <laughs> the council has spoken. Yes. How much time do we have left? <laughs> <laughs> Another 30. That was only 30. We've only done 30 minutes. Wow, really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a, I think it was a solid wrap-up 30. Can we do oh, we could just end it here. 30? Are we just doing a? Are we just ending no, it? Now? Well, no. I, I don't know if that's the move or not. I'm just saying. I'm just patting myself on the back for a solid first thirty minutes. You did awesome. Mm -hmm. Where was that in the first hundred episodes? <laughs> <laughs> Where were all the ancestry? Uh, Where were all yeah ancestry and, updates every yeah. episode? <laughs> mm. uh, what about favorite memories of the podcast? I bet people would like to hear that. Yeah, you know what? That's a that's a good one. Um, can I can I have a moment to think? You guys want to Don, take the... you started this mm -hmm. one off. I'm trying to think too. I uh, rather enjoyed when Don abducted those two dogs. Mm -hmm. that, that is a good episode. 
I still think my favorite. I think the best is uh, Rooster Teeth hates us. I think that's the best episode. That was a banger. That story. I'm glad that story got out there in that way because, like, that's not the first time I've told that story, but that is the most funny time I've told that story. Yeah, that was uh, that was a really really fun story to. I I I, have all the podcasts because I've re listened to a couple and stuff, and that's one that I've always I come back to. Mm. There's a there's got to be two or three left uncovered too. That happened as well. Stories. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no more, no Flash more get, Tom no and Don more, stories. No more Flash gets cringe. Yeah. Now we get to fucking bury them. Mm-hmm. That are experienced new ones we, in mysterious they'll ways. They'll never get out. Yeah, it's just, it's just, it's out there. It's the, it's the hope. It's the nice factor of like they're gonna keep doing it. Probably. Mm. I don't think it's any. Definitely. Day. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, you went to a resort with us, a little writers retreat. Did we? Well, he hasn't it? said his favorite. There? No. Oh, okay. Sorry. Or no, no, I don't think so. <laughs> there yeah. you go. Maybe we're getting better. Wait, what? What was your what's your favorite memory, John? I like the Dragon. Oh, Balls. I right. like the Dragon Ball Z episode a lot. I like that one uh, was funny. To whatever I was talking about, um, wondering if I'm sterile because I we used to wick my balls with deodorant. That was cool. <laughs> and that's yeah, that's uh, you, you think of that that from time to time. I also know. like the shower, the the hole in the shower story. That's a good one. Hole in the sh- oh yeah, well that was my dad's story. But yeah, yeah. Well, still, just saying, uh-huh. it's a good memory. Damn, it's a good one. Mm-hmm. It's a good memory. I think the first Missy episode was fun. Mm-hmm. She was good. I was in the studio, and she, you guys just got her absolutely drunk as fuck. I got fucked up too because you guys had a little pool party at Tom's house, and I couldn't drive. So I was I was like laying on the floor in my office watching Attack on Titan for three hours <laughs> trying to sober up. <laughs> yeah, because that was when we were making weeb still. Mm. It is interesting. Um, on some of the episodes, as you go back, you can kind of see like we 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 do. I think data in a really fun way though of like oh what your cartoon releases this week yep and then to see like the mm. aftermath of that that'd be fun which is almost always too. negative no no it's not it's usually okay. pretty sad oh. They never perform as good as you'd hope, <laughs> you know. No, I just mean for like a, a listener, you know. Oh yeah, yeah, I think that's fun then, because it's like that's you can see the exact time of what was happening. Yeah. You know, <sighs> pleasant part of the Cream Crew experience, I think the hope at the beginning, the excitement of uh, launching something new. Mm-hmm. That was fun. Just uh, <laughs> three boys yeah. coming together to. Seeing the new comments, getting a new batch of fans for something new. It was definitely something that I've I've like found with the second channel at least. I'm sure you guys will find too. That's like, it feels nice getting comments on something that isn't like uh, so fucking life or death, excruciating. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like in terms of like how hard the work is and stuff. Mm. Well, like, ironically, this work was incredibly hard. <clears throat> it was. It was. It was daunting for sure. This is. This was within itself should be. A full time thing on YouTube. Like I, I understand why people now are like, they just do podcast shit because mm-hmm. it's just. I mean, to gather enough stuff. Also, it's just I, I, another thing with this podcast is I just don't have enough to talk about. I feel like I'm. I don't. I don't know. I feel like a lot of time it was just a lot of the rehashing <laughs> of shit, or I forget. I immediately forget what we talk about, <laughs> so I'll just rehash the same shit over and over again. The problem uh, is you. You always had more than us, and we just had nothing. And that I I I, mm, mm, I in I in particular felt like I had nothing because I had no like l- less so now but before like no life at all just like work and mm. sleep and you know like watch a movie or something and that was it like nothing would go on and recently we've uh, tried to sort our pipeline out and like make it a little better and like I'm you know trying to do more and more stuff but but yeah it was just weird like I I don't, I don't think there's a real understanding of uh how hard it is to sit down once a week and come up with anything, you know, say. And it's or just something entertaining. Yeah. It's it, easy to sit down and do nothing, like have nothing, but it's just like to do something that people give a fuck about mm-hmm. or like joke, you know, have good jokes and stuff. <laughs> you run out of stories and you're not making any new stories. because you're just Not that we ever really planned. I mean, like we tried to do some planned stuff, but I think a lot of it was just very much like sit down and see how it goes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, you had uh, something to say. That made it really hard to sit down every week. And it woe is us. <laughs> we had to try sit down once a week for an hour. It's hard whenever you're like wanting, wanting it to be something more. People resolved. are probably wondering why we're ending it. And uh, I was, you know, jesting earlier, but literally every episode gets less views than the last. And Trevor's gone. Trevor died. 
Mm-hmm. Well, he went back to where he came from before. Who knows where that is? He's dead. <laughs> he got a purple heart in the service of the country. That's true. Yeah, Trevor got a purple that heart. True. And, uh, yeah, true. He had to go on the biggest to the um, box. I think flight, that, and you know, people over. people will be like, "Well, views aren't everything, all that kind of stuff." I think it was just it, it's more along the lines of, at least for me, is that like the podcast has lost a lot of the initial fun that it's had, mm-hmm. and it's like we're trying to make it something that would ease our lives with our main channel stuff, and I feel like it's like done the opposite. It just, <laughs> it's just this fucking mountain that you have to climb every week. That after a while, you're just like, oh god. And seriously, it's it's probably hard to appreciate why well, why is it hard to sit here and talk for an hour? And like what's what's so difficult about that? You pay an editor, you talk for an hour, like what's the big deal? But yeah, as you were saying, like you run out of funny stories and no new stuff happens because we just make fucking cartoons every week and yeah, it's just like it's like pulling teeth most of the time. I think that a lot of our minds I, and I, I guess when I say like it's hard to do that, I think it's it's not so much like it, it, in no way is a pity thing. It's just like literally, I think that we're just like oh, we just don't have a lot to say after a while. Mm-hmm. That or if, and then I think that a lot of the time too, I can tell you, you can probably see episodes where like one of us isn't as talkative or something, or mostly me. I let my mental fucking state affect my performance a lot of the time if <clears throat> I'm stressed with shit or anything else is going on. And like the last thing that you want to do if you're like in the thick of something like a pipeline thing is sit down in this godforsaken room and have to fucking joke your way through two hours or something like that so do you think this podcast has affected our relationships with each other i'm absolutely a must have like there's just no way it can't well i guess consciously have you have you thought about it i hate tom a lot more than i did a year and a half ago do you think so really Mm -hmm. that's surprising because i've uh i don't know i feel like your life around me is essentially a constant podcast <laughs> so i can't imagine why an extra hour would uh-huh. change anything um i think that ending the podcast will result in because when you when you have a working relationship it's more it's there's more uh weight on each other mm-hmm. so like inevitably removing that component i think lets you just exist more as friends and less like colleagues. I, yeah i think that are like i think there'll be like more of an active thing about being like do you guys want to hang out or something like that will happen more even like i think that people are going to think that like a, a week isn't a long time either like once a week isn't a long time but there's also just things about going of like being at a place at a certain time like it's just there's like it's a constant thing of being like in work mode with each other Mm-hmm. and stuff and then also on top of that you're trying to like assist each other or be like uh positive towards like main channel production shit so it's like it just it 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 it, it did feel like for a long time that it was just like n- there was no separation of like we're buddies doing this mm-hmm. as much as it just felt like we work together like that's what it felt so like do you think it affected our relationship i definitely didn't want to be around you as much mm. I mm-hmm. think, but I think that's just once again, it's just because like if something happens, like I, I, I'm just using this as like, like if, if, if there was a hiccup or something happened or like something weird or whatever, like if uh, you pissed me off during the day or with something you said that you probably didn't mean to, or, or if, or, 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 yeah, or, or, yeah, or, or, <laughs> for sure. Mm-hmm. Or if like uh, just a little petty shit. I mean, like I'm, I, I don't know. I, mean, I think a lot of us are probably pretty selfish to a degree about like wanting things to rotate rotate around a certain way so i think it's just a matter of like look at don as well i think it's just a matter of <laughs> i don't know i mean like it, it, they, we all have our things like we all did shit that probably pissed each other off it's just one of those yeah but then it, but as you were saying earlier though where it's like if there's no reward to it and it's just this thing where it's like <laughs> you're being fucking like you're hanging yourself every week essentially it's like what the, like why are we doing this you know yeah It'd be different if it was just like, well, we just have so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> we did have some good laughs, at least. Oh, yeah. A lot of good, good times, good memories and stuff. And also, we gave it a good college try. We did. Certainly gave it a we, good I college mean, try. There's no, nobody can say that we didn't try. We did everything that we possibly could. I fucking moved here for this kind of thing. I mean, one, to be around people, like other people and stuff, but a large part of it was to be, mm-hmm. to elevate the show. That was a huge part of that. We built the set. Don spent a shit ton of time on this set. Justin came over, helped build these walls, all this kind of stuff. I mean, like, as an entire group effort, I think that there was, like, we, we, we really did try. 
It just, uh, I don't know, just didn't, never connected. We, and, we and hired, that happens. We, try, we hired, have, uh, fuck me, we hired Trevor <laughs> mm. to uh, try and give it a fucking punch up the old asshole. But, uh, just to like make it even more streamlined and try to make it more exciting and stuff. But it just was, it. Uh, I don't know, it just, it, yeah, it's like, it just wasn't in the cards. I don't know. Yeah, you win some, you lose some. You do, and that's just the way it is, you know. That's life. <clears throat> I do think it'll be a lot better around here without it, as you're saying. I wonder if people are going to show up more. <laughs> what do you mean? I just feel like you. Know, I'll come to the studio more. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like uh, I feel like I avoid this place like the plague. Sometimes I'm like, I'll just work from home or whatever. Would you? Would this? Would seeing this table regularly upset you? Like if I put this in the kitchen? I just don't want to do no, it. No, I mean, I think, I'm I think sentimental I'd, I'd and I like, want to get rid of it. So I'd like to see it more. I like the table. It's cool. Mm. It wouldn't upset me. No, I mean, I was even trying to think about how we would break this up or whatever. Because if nobody, I mean, like, I have my own selfish wants for this room, but I'm trying to make it sure that's like everybody gets a say in how we use it or whatever. Mm-hmm. So, mm. well, we can figure that out. But uh, I feel like I would be upset seeing the table. Would every you? Day. Just more of a like, <laughs> yeah. constant reminder. Just like yeah, yeah, but on the same token, it's uh, extremely petty. So I don't give a fuck. You can just put it wherever you want, and you know I'll get over myself. I, mean, I also don't know what to do with it, honestly. Like otherwise, and yeah, it would I, make a good three man surfboard. I have mixed feelings about it. I guess. Yeah. We could all fucking all three of us stand on it at once and surf. Mm-hmm. Could you put it in the wood shop? Is there any room in there for something like that that could no. be useful? No, I mean, it would just get destroyed. Anyway. What no. if we took it to whatever local pride parade is going on at any given time mm. and sold any it to parade. them? Yeah, just go sell it. No, to this is this isn't map. I don't think this is trans. I thought I, was, I thought people were saying that it's the map. Flag. I think I think it is trans. The map is very similar though, which is oh, okay. unfortunate. I mean, maybe we're getting both comments. Then I can't mm. remember. I also I wore this in to match. You know, mm. as the final mm. commemorance, some like ice cream, that. some ice cream comes. <laughs> Seeing the white on that makes me wish that we had a white in the. Oh, we never sold a shirt, shirt guys. We never what sold what shirt. merch would we have made if we had gone to? We talked about the last scoop T-shirt, you know, or going out of business T-shirt to end this off. But oh. um, well, we can we can hold. Why our, not uh, open a spreadsheet? We can hold our. <laughs> so we can open a spreadsheet. We, and we can hold the, our head high, knowing that people had to sit through a couple ads. There it is. We, we, we sit through a couple ads. You know, we never pushed any merch on them or anything like that. We can hold yeah, but they wanted, they wanted merch, though. You know? They think they It wanted. was more like it's we just held a, back merch from right, them. I, I, I will make a spreadsheet. I'll do all the work, and I'll take all the profits, and I'll uh, make that the pinned like comment. Like hell. Yeah, I will no, see you. <laughs> I will see the shell structure of this corporation, and mm-hmm. you better hope we kept meeting minutes, otherwise we're going to lose our LLC veil. And then mm. I get to come for your personal shit. Kept what? The, the LLC veil. Yeah, the, yeah, what was the other part? Kept meetings? Kept meeting minutes. Meeting minutes. Oh, okay. You know, mm. there's several there's several yeah. criteria to prove that your LLC is a legit LLC mm-hmm. in a court of law. And if you don't adhere to a certain amount of them, you're at risk of losing your pr- legal protection from an LLC. So, How much time do we have left here? Uh, mm. Well, I could open up a Wikipedia article on LLC structure About and 10 just minutes. finish out the last 10 minutes. Mm. That's, that's uh, I mean... If we're being honest, that's a pretty productive, cool way to learn about an LLC in a in the last ten minutes of an episode. So we've discovered that um, podcasts are quite a drain on the main workflow. Do right. you agree? Mm-hmm. And uh, you know, I will I will then lead with this now that you've activated my trap card, <gasps> Hunter. Would you like to tell the people about your new podcast that you're leaving this one for? No, I can't. Oh, so Never dude. mind. <laughs> also, I also I want to say that I'm not leaving this podcast for that. I don't I don't want to end on that note because we'll, we'll I even to we'll be see fair, what the comments look say. me in the eyes and even say that I didn't call you and ask you about it and tell and it was an excruciating thing. And I even made it to where it's like a limited series thing. It's not even a full you, thing. You I was it. very respectful. You said. You know, I know you're offering me 2,000 episodes, but I just can't do it. I've got to do six. That's what happened. Mm. Mm-hmm. L- yeah. So try try to look at me and say that I wasn't as respectful <laughs> as I possibly could have fucking been towards it. You were. You I don't want to give it because if you put that out there, they're going to be like, oh, me, kid, he's broken up, whatever. It's bullshit. Okay. It has nothing to do okay. with it. It's awful defensive. You're going to have to send <laughs> notes to the editor. Yeah, well, is, yeah, is there anything else you'd like to cover yourself with? Because as you know, we cannot edit this episode. Well, we can. I'm just No, we, we, yeah, You no, can edit I. it if you want. Mm. 
Joe. We we literally should just like sync it up and just upload it. Mm. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Not even do the post processing on the audio. Should we, should we even do like a thumbnail, or should it just be like one of the things where it's like this like <laughs> auto generated, the yeah. auto generated one that yeah. you get from uploading to YouTube. Yeah, I'm down. Let uh, let old fucking let I'd fate decide but, who is but, the face of this end. <laughs> at the same time, I really want uh, it to say episode 100 and to feel like part of the set. It can know? still do that. Th- yeah. Or did, were I you think, saying like I, video 001? I think you still do it. Oh no, I mean, I think no, you, I think, no, you give yeah, it a title. Yeah, I think you do it 100, and you have like fireworks for the image part. You know? Yeah, just like a celebration. big hundred in the middle yeah. of the. <laughs> so do we are we catfishing people that it's like a big celebration or are we gonna have something foreshadowing that it's, it's the doom i i think uh, it's a celebration in both regards i think, I think, I think it's the it, end it's, it's celebrating the, celebrate the death celebrate the ending yeah, yeah it's like it, a public hanging probably <laughs> <laughs> probably has to be the uh last episode though you want people to watch it you know they'll show up for the beginning of the end episode very successful episode all those people that were ignoring us all this time, passively seeing, oh, this oh, they're like, oh no, not, not our favorite podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, then where yeah. were you? I will say this: I do want to put out there that I would legitimately really love if people commented their favorite moments and stuff. I that like, would be nice. I would actually like to read through that and see mm-hmm. if you liked it. Oh, fucking the the, the fifty people commenting! I would really love to hear your favorite. <laughs> I think that the I think the Hobbit thing was probably the best best bit. That was really funny. That, that was, was a, that was a lot of fun. Boys, yeah. when we hit, we fucking hit. The Melissa mm-hmm. McCarthy also being in also, the Lord of the Rings thing that was, that was pretty funny. Yeah. Yeah. I still mm-hmm. it also thoroughly enjoyed. I remember I had a lot of fun, and I thought that it was going to be really popular amongst the fans. The Ethan Hawke one, mm-hmm. the ghost mm-hmm. dog one. Yeah, him raping the dog. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited for them to dig up this podcast in 20 years. And mm-hmm. I, I truly believe this is also, like, literally with the amount of episodes we have, I think that people could come across it, binge it, and I think it has it's, it has the value of having multiple listens. Can you pass me that copium? I'd like to take a half. It's fucking awesome, dude. It's going to be great. I can't wait for people to discover the gold mine, the emerald mine. Mm-hmm. Just, just gems in the dirt. Everywhere you turn, oh! Wow. <laughs> I, I literally think that it has been a really good show. It, mm. is, a, it is a good show that no, one listen, that no one listened to. No yeah. one listened to. Yeah. yeah. So. It is what it is. <laughs> you know, boys, uh, usually this kind of uh, narcissistic woe is me shit I would get edited out. Mm. Mm. But it's just going up straight so people finally get to see the real us. Mm-hmm. I is it narcissistic? Yeah, you think I so? Know. I don't think so. What's narcissistic I'm, about it? I'm just, I'm just stirring. Oh, I see. Trying yeah. to get final dregs, <laughs> final few fucking gems out of this podcast. Well, I, uh, <laughs> yeah, I like, I like feeling like uh, people know where we sit. I think it's a good, uh, it's a positive end. I don't think it's, you know, could have been terrible. Could have been us hating each other and just ending it that way, or somebody moving away and just have to do it out of that kind of thing. But it's nice. It's good. It's good. Scud. Scud. Is that the final catchphrase? Scud. 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 S. Uh, comma. G O D. Scud. Scud. What's going to happen? Right, right, right. What's right, going right, to happen? Right, right. No, no, no. What's going to happen? A, li- a little medley of the famous moments. Right, right, pirate right, crew. Right, 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 right. Yar. Yar. Walk the plank. You walk the plank, you scurvy. I'm going to go. Catch us in uh, three months. The launch of Ki- Pirate Crew. Redo the set. If we relaunched this Pirate Crew, this is a whole. I think people would actually be legit. I'm going to go. It's been a while since I've done that, so I feel rusty. I'm going to go. Eventually, it needs to devolve into the super high pitch. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> what were you gonna say? I can't remember. Oh, what's happening to Linda? What's happening? What to Linda? Oh, he's gonna frame it. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna frame it. I've, yeah, we were, I've, we're, I've, we're always go. gonna make a video for Cream Crew though about you going it, and getting it framed. Yeah. So. Well, we yeah, we yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, it's already been a mental hurdle being like. Calling even, up there even and asking. Her and asking. Right. Yeah, it feels weird because mm. I because I want to preface and be like, "Hey, I, I'm the person that's been up there and I've had like a mm. billion things framed so far." What if you get the can other thing not, framed and also can we not then? go get kicked well, out of and banned from Hobby Lobby first? <laughs> well, if, I don't know. Is it, is it cool seeing thirty year old men do that? I feel like it's not. I feel like if I mean. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Well, regardless, I want to tell her and be like, hey, I'm bringing in, because I am getting the other painting framed, and be like, hey, I want to bring in a painting, but I also have 
this like illustration marker thing that I wanted to get really nicely framed because I think it'd be funny, but it is crude. So that way I'm not just showing up and it's like it's a bit more than crude. You, sh- you should say crude. I'd say crude and lewd. Kind of hot. She's she's, say. <laughs> she's German, man. She she doesn't give a fuck. She'll she'll find it funny. I swear. Maybe I'll just have a maybe I'll just have the assistant take it up there and do it. She yeah. I don't know if she'll have the same kick out of it. <laughs> Why? She's American. I see. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were saying you'd get your assistant to go. That's what I was saying. Oh, uh, gotcha. I thought you meant the assistant at the framing shop. <laughs> that's, that's oh, funny. yeah. No, if I had uh, Harry. It, yeah, but you yeah. should do that. That would be funny. Like, hey, can you go get these frames? And he's like, sorry. <laughs> I mean, you do want this job, right? <laughs> yeah, I'd just be a total tyrant it's, about dude, it. What do you mean she didn't frame him? Go back. Go, go fucking back. tell. Is, does she not do this Wait, for a so living? The paintings have just been sitting in the hot car for how long? <laughs> You know that's an original one of one. <laughs> that's a one of one, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a Donald J. Gregor. Uh huh. Mm, J. K. K. Fuck. What, what did you think my middle name was? I don't Jerry. Know. J- Jerry. I don't know. Oh, I, you know, you know, probably. Are, are you a junior or is your dad yeah, junior? I'm a junior? Okay, well, his dad was probably a junior at one point too. I feel like it shifts. No, he wasn't. He was never a real junior. But isn't name. your grandpa named Don? <laughs> yeah, but they changed his middle name. You have to be fully the yeah, full yeah, name. Yeah. Oh, you the need full, the full fucking yeah. the whole hog, huh? I never knew. Yeah. Seems backwards, doesn't it? It's weird. It's like my first and last name. That's a, uh, that's all anybody cares about. It's the first and last name. But. Wait, I thought you were like Hungarian and oh, Romanian. that would be this. That would be the Eastern Europe. Yeah, yeah, Hungarian. But uh, it's weird. It's only fifteen percent because they've always both said like, yeah, there's a bunch of. Uh, Is it possible that the gene- different genetic combinations can register of like a child? different percentages from each lineage from mm. each line your parents right could it create a different concoction like if you got a dna test and your brother and your sister is it not possible that maybe the percentages are different no because our ancestors are the same so well, okay but put it like this right let's say you've but, got 50 percent hungarian on no, your mum's side yeah no i know what you're saying because you're saying like just, just by virtue of being a different, because she has different DNA from me. She's not a clone of me. Yeah. Right. But at the same time, all this is about is my ancestry. Like, by, like, yes or no, they were this or that. Like, other people that, and we share the same ancestors. We have the exact same ancestors. No, I know. So, I get that. But could it? Could they show up in different percentages? I, I guess I don't know. What, it maybe seems when like you maybe get down to like the itty bitty percentages, maybe that's possible. But like I, if if you it, this is zero point zero. <laughs> There's no there wasn't a blip of noise. It wasn't like zero point one. You know, be like, oh, that's in, maybe hers is just more for some reason. But yeah, oh, or like, maybe your fucking mom or dad has some, or your uh, mom has some fucking explaining to do. So. What was going on in your phone that uh, interrupted the last five minutes of our joint venture? Yeah, that was really disrespectful. Yeah. People that have been here from the beginning, you know. There are some people who have listened to every episode religiously. Mm-hmm. I do want to say thank you for people that, I guess, have made it so much a part. Because I do see so many great, wonderful comments about people being like, you know, especially like they l- listen to it on their way to work or while they're at work or all that kind of stuff. is always cool to see. I think it's probably, it's kind of a gay thing to say, but probably the worst and hardest part of this is all the people to say like like it seems like it's genuinely like a big part of their week to listen to it and mm. like feel better at work or whatever you know sorry so. <sighs> however what are you gonna do you well know? i'll tell you what you're gonna do uh there's mm-hmm. four, about forty five thousand listeners and when you say it like that it sounds like we're kind of quitting something cool but if you guys want to carry on hearing from us uh particularly me all 45,000 of you could uh, go to f- at Flash Gets Tom on Instagram yeah, and Twitter. F- dude. Edit, edit this part. Edit this part. You, I said f- anyway, so you have to brush over this. No, I, said, I said it twice, so <laughs> brush over it. No, I mean, it's there. It's not. Brush, brush over it. I'm not dead. You don't want to try and get a few of those followers. Yeah, you, you're, taking, you're trying to take them all to yourself. Well, so you they can, can go you can look say at, your piece in so a So they can go look at mutton shot photos you took six months ago. You, do you have a few more of those to post? You're going to scare I them out? I have some with just a moustache, too. Mm-hmm. I quite the bank. <laughs> My job six months ago. <laughs> and mm. also, I'm growing them back. <laughs> you should. So soon back. there'll be new pictures of mutton I chops. I th- literally think you should just make that your look. He's, he's I'm go- going he's to. Going mu- he's mutton chops, not mustache. Oh, we're gonna that's we're gonna complete that's each the other. Flash gets thing. You'd yeah. be funny if you were just this part. So it would be like if you took your chin. Oh, it, oh, it oh I did think that, but yeah, I'm not not gonna do it no, actually. No. So. So anyway, at Flash Gets Tom at Twitter or Instagram. Mm-hmm. Um, don't listen to Jealous Don. At Jealous fly, of my numbers. At Flash Gets Don at Twitter and Instagram. 
you don't need any more followers. Uh, just mm-hmm. keep it to me and then Don, if you want to add nothing to your life. You want to see good art. If you're a fan of my content, I have a second no, channel that yeah, you should check you out. you got enough out of your greedy, silly sausage. Is this the end right here, though? Is this, or should we say our final piece? That's an hour. Feels, oh, is it an hour? Mm-hmm. I mean, it could right. be the end. It just feels like maybe a bitter way to end it. I thought that I said which so I, we, guy, we could hated the ending. We could end it on. Well, uh, yeah, but it was pleasant. I was all like, you know, you can follow us, blah 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 blah. blah and, then, f- <laughs> and then Don's like, oh, fuck you, dude! What the hell? Mm-hmm. And now it's now it's weird, and I don't know if that should be the final words. I've had the time of my life. That's a lie. And, and uh, I owe it and all. And I owe it all to you. Oh, I've had the time of my life. No, I've never felt this way before. Yes, I swear, this is true. You help me out here with some. And I owe it all to you. Oh, I've had the time of my life. And I've never felt this way before. I actually resent that as the ending. I don't know what a good ending would be, but I resent that. You don't like the song? <laughs> that in right. harmony? I thought it was kind of cute. It was nice. You mm-hmm. could have joined in. I didn't want to. Okay. That, this just, is actually the perfect just, end right just here. sitting it out. Yeah. We could just sit here for three minutes of silence and just... <laughs> oh, a little timer. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. So three minutes of silence, one each for the end of Cream Crew. <laughs> so nine minutes in total. No, one mm. minute each. No, no. Oh, one I minute see. each. Yeah. And rest in peace.